He's performed over 1,500 times at the famous Flamingo Las Vegas, where Mr. Piffles was also recently given the keys to the city for his 16th birthday. Yes, you can catch Piff the Magic Dragon every night at 7 p.m., where his residency has been extended through 2024, and he's joining us now. Good morning, Piff. Good morning. This hey. is Mr. Piffles. Yes, oh. Mr. Piffles. Oh. Well, that's gonna, that's gonna, that's intercepted. Gonna fly intercepted. Over. I know, that's right. It's fine. I yes. got the You have a job as well. <laughs> I have a job too. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You're going to examine the dog, and you're going to examine this Rubik's Cube. Oh, my God. Have a look at it. Regulation oh, Rubik's Cube, right? Nice sure, yeah. yeah. Right. It seems regulation. <laughs> it's as, it's as, this is exactly the same as mine is back home at my mum's house right there now. There are no switches that make it solve itself. There are no stickers that peel off. No, no? there's no, no, no. Great. You're going to do me a favor. You're going to place that Rubik's Cube in here. Very good. Just over here. Okay. And you're going to put Mr. Piffles <gasps> in with the Rubik's Cube. You do. Otherwise, okay. you will taste you. Okay. Just place the Rubik's <laughs> Mr. Piffles in. There you go. All right. Bye, Mr. Piffles. Right. Now, a dog is going to solve the Rubik's Cube. You ready? That's incredible. Okay. I'll take it away, buddy. You hear that? Yeah. You hear that? A dog is literally solving a Rubik's Cube. A dog. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Yesterday, he did it in four hours and 32 minutes. Still quicker than me. Come on, buddy. You can do no it. No way. Oh, sounds like he's finished. He's finished. Give it up for little Mr. Piffle. Wait a second. Oh. Oh. Oh, really? Oh. What? You think you can do better? No, I can't <laughs> do it. No, you take that one. If that's how it's going to be, you take that one. I've got another one over here. We're going to have a Rubik's Cube. I want to see, I wanna see how far you get yeah, with this we're going to have a Rubik's Cube solving I've battle. Here we go. Take okay. it away again, Mr. Piffle. Right. Oh, God. I've seen this documentary on, where these kids do this on, in like three all seconds. Si all sides the same color. You're not yep. so cocky now, are you? Well, I mean, I wasn't cocky in the first place, Piff, but I mean, I get, I get it. Hang yeah, I mean, you... But what no, you've got to match it. What, I'm just, that's, if that I get one, be, if I get right, one side right. match, I, I'm I don't know how it goes finished. Yeah. Oh, terrible. Oh, terrible. Really, goodness. you've embarrassed. I'm colorblind. You've embarrassed yourself, <laughs> and you've embarrassed your country. Let's see how Mr. Pibbles has done. Oh, oh in your face. Oh my goodness. How about that? Wow. What? Wow. What? Well, they're both, huh. they're both kind of the same, aren't they? Did he? Well, he oh. got some. He got some he blue got there. Oh, they're both kind of the same. No, they're both. Exactly the same. Mr. Pill wasn't solving your Rubik's Cube. This time he was solving this time he was solving your Rubik's Cube. That side no. and that side matches perfectly. That side no. and that side what? matches perfectly. What? That side and that side. No. Every single one of the sides of the cube matches what? perfectly. Give it up for little Mr. Pivols. Mr. Pivols! Wow, I never knew dogs could be that sarcastic, but he just this mocked is, me this is great. By, by maxing, ma maxing you, out my, my Rubik's Cube. You got outsmarted by You just got done by a pup. tiny dog. It's unusual. By a little pup. I just call that Wednesday. Yay, Mr. Bill! Yay! <laughs> so that, that gives everyone a taste and a flavor <laughs> as to what they can expect of your this show. This is the talent. Yeah. Yes. Well, you've hit a landmark number of shows. Yes. I, talk to us about what this has been like. I performed 1,500 shows. Whew. Mr. Pibbles has performed 1,498 because he missed two. Christmas 2018. I didn't know if that was maybe a contractual dispute with not wanting to work with you anymore, or...? Wow! Well, don't listen to him, buddy. <laughs> uh, it's incredible. We've been at the Flamingo now for eight years. We spent five years in the Little Bugsy's Cabaret, and then three years ago we got promoted to the big main Flamingo showroom, taking over from Donny and Marie, and we've, uh, we extended now until the end of 24. What is it about, it about performing in Vegas that you guys love? Because obviously you've been the here cash. for so long. The cash? The cash. Yeah. He's honest. <laughs> we, just, we love the money. Just We love it. <laughs> That's yeah. a beautiful thing. Yeah. Dragons love gold, you see. Well, obviously. We uh. sleep on treasure. Uh -huh. It's very difficult to sleep when, you, when you're poor. <laughs> you don't have any treasure to sleep on. Well, who are some of your biggest influences? Penn and Teller, obviously. Yeah, of course. The OGs, DC, mm -hmm. down at MGM. You know, the great... That's the thing. Like, Vegas is like the mecca of magic. Jade, who's in my show, Jade and I met because of Lance Burton. Remember Lance? He did 15,000 shows. 15,000 shows, <laughs> buddy. 50, you got a long way to go. What, what first got you into, into, into you know, comedy and magic? What, what, what were your inspirations behind that? Why did, why did you decide to pursue that as a, as a career? Well, because when I did magic seriously, everyone just laughed at me. OK. Hmm. So I was like, let's make a go of this. Yeah. Nice. Let's do it for reals. Let's do it for real, exactly. <laughs> apparently, I can't do, apparently, nobody takes a genuine mythical creature seriously in this day and age anymore. They're just like, oh, he says he's a dragon. Ha, ha, ha. That's, you know, kids today, right? Yeah. Mr. Piffles has the key to the city. Yeah. How does, does. that feel? I mean, uh, he's like the star. He's the star of the show, yeah. Yeah, he is the star. He's got the key to the city. Nobody told us where the lock was. 
<laughs> oh. So gags. we're just going around testing doors at the moment. <laughs> All right, guys. Now, to witness the majesty of Piff and Mr. Piffles in person, head to PiffTheMagicDragon.com and get yourself some tickets to an incredible show.